Hi everyone, latest news about animal rights activist Hema Chaudhary on 5th August 2020. Mumbai-based animal rights activist remanded to judicial custody. Mumbai-based animal rights activist Hema Chaudhary, who was brought to Koima by the Nagaland police on July 20, has been remanded to judicial custody on August 4. The accused was arrested on charges of making derogatory remarks targeting Nagaland. PRO of Nagaland Police Headquarter, SP Crime Manoj Kumar, told that since police remand period has been completed, she has been allowed to undergo judicial custody as per procedure and was subsequently forwarded yesterday. She had undergone police remand period for 14 days. The question of trial does not arise now because investigation is not over, the PRO said. After a charge sheet is submitted on completion of investigation, then the trial will commence. The PRO further stated that all SOPs laid out by the Health and Family Welfare Department for returnees coming from outside Nagaland as well as the procedure needed to follow for an accused in the court as prescribed by the Gwadi High Court have been followed. However, the COVID-19 test results of Chowdhury, the two police escort and their driver could not be confirmed during the time of filing this report. The Cybercrime Police Station registered a case under Section 153A, 153B, 505-1, of the IPC, read with Section 3R3S3U of the SCST Prevention of Atrocities Act. In an earlier press release issued by Nagaland Police PRO, Chowdhury had posted a video on YouTube and Facebook on July 4, in which the said person has made derogatory statements against the Nagas, conducing to public mischief and also promoting enmity between different groups of people, which is prejudicial to maintenance of harmony. The Chief Judicial Magistrate Koima issued a non-bailable warrant of arrest against Chowdhury. Subsequently, a Nagaland police team was sent to Mumbai on July 15 and effected her arrest from her Oshiwara residence in the city. In coordination with the Mumbai police on July 17, she was finally brought to Koima on July 20. That's all for now. To get such latest news, don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Thank you.